Brisbane City Council um, serves a population of Brisbane which is about 1.1 million people. We have 7,500 employees. We do everything from books to buses. In 2004, we had a safety record which we wish to improve. We set about implementing zero harm as a way of capturing the hearts and minds of our employees and that was successful. Since then, we've developed further by integrating it into a holistic model encapsulating wellness, safety and health and really driven that message across the organisation. Everything from compliance and governance under the Workplace Health and Safety Act through to the provision of wellness centres, fully equipped gyms within two of our buildings, outreach programmes where we go out to work groups across the city to assist them with programmes to improve and maintain their health and we operate the workers' compensation and rehabilitation service to get people back as quickly as possible in a sustainable way into their jobs. By bringing all those things together means that now employees can see the end-to-end -end process, the linkages between their own personal wellness and the safety outcomes we're trying to achieve through Zero Harm. There's a clear commitment by executive management team and the chief executive that Zero Harm is a priority. If we can't do it safely, we don't do it at all. I think across Queensland generally we're seen as a market leader in this area and we take every opportunity we can to tell people about what it is we do and the impact that's having. About 60% of our employees have engaged in wellness interventions and activities over the last 12 months. We've seen our lost time injury frequency rate drop from around 16% to around 5% in the last three years. Our savings for workers' compensation against an actuarial assessment run in the region of $13 million. And we've seen uh, about a 30% reduction in our lost time injuries. I think all employees recognise the benefits the organisation provides in wellness, safety and health and how that helps them stay healthy and safe in the workplace.